CSAP 2025 Round 1, Cutoff Analysis and Expected CSAP 2025 Special Round 2 Cutoff. Triple ITDM Jabalpur. Are you curious to know if your rank can still secure you a seat at Triple ITDM Jabalpur in the upcoming CSAB Special Round 2? With CSAB Round 1 results already out on the 9th of August, we now have real numbers to compare with our earlier predictions, and the accuracy might just surprise you. Welcome to Enlighten JEE, your trusted source for expert guidance on engineering colleges, in depth placement analysis, and data backed admission predictions. In this video, we'll analyze the CSAB Round 1 cutoffs branch wise, compare them with our predicted ranges, and give you fresh, data backed predictions for Special Round 2 so you can secure your dream seat without waiting for the last round. Trust me, you'll want to watch till the end because the trends this year are unlike previous years. How accurate are our predictions? In our earlier video, CSAB 2025 expected cutoff, triple ITDM Jabalpur, link in description, we forecasted the closing ranks for the overall CSAB 2025 process. What's remarkable is that with only round 1 declared, many of our predictions are already matching or well within reach to be achieved in round 2 or round 3. This shows the accuracy of our approach, and it's why thousands of students trust our analysis. Our predictions aren't wild guesses, they are the result of AI-powered forecasting models, deep statistical analysis of last three years of Joseph plus CSAP trends, an expert review to account for special factors in 2025, like the extra CSAP round this year. Before we dive into the fresh round two predictions, let's quickly check how our earlier expected ranges matched up with the actual round one results. Computer Science and Engineering For open, gender-neutral, we predicted CSAB 2025 expected cutoff 16,300 to 17,600. Round 1 closed at 16,009, almost there, and likely to be within range in the coming rounds. For the open category female, prediction for CSAB 2025 expected cutoff was 25,200 to 26,700. Round 1 closed at 24,767, again, almost there and likely to be within range in the coming rounds. For OBCNCL, gender neutral, prediction for CSAB 2025 expected cutoff was 25,200 to 26,800. Round 1 closed at 22,181, a faster fill than usual, yet still likely to be within range in the coming rounds. And for OBCNCL female, we predicted CSAB 2025 expected cutoff 36,000 to 38,500, and the round 1 ended at 37,595, already achieved, perfectly inside our expected band. Electronics and Communication Engineering For open category, gender neutral, our CSAP 2025 expected cutoff range was 20,900 to 22,300, and the round 1 closing rank was 20,409, almost there, likely to be hit in the coming rounds. For open category female, the expected CSAB cutoff range was 32,500 to 34,000, and round 1 closed at 32,968, already achieved, perfectly inside our expected band. For OBCNCL, gender neutral, our CSAB expected cutoff range was 30,200 to 32,000. Round 1 closed at 27,213, almost there, likely to be hit in the coming rounds but is a strong signal of earlier seat locking in this branch. For OBCNCL female, we expected CSAB cutoff range 44,000 to 46,000, and the round 1 closing was 47,518, already achieved, even better than expected. Mechanical Engineering For open category, gender neutral, our CSAB 2025 expected cutoff range was 48,000 to 52,000, and the round 1 closing rank was 48,079, almost there, likely to be hit in the coming rounds. For open category female, the prediction for CSAB was 61,000 to 65,000, and round 1 closed at 71,357, much higher than expected, showing slower movement in this category. For OBCNCL, gender neutral, we expected CSAB cut off 67,500 to 72,000, and the round 1 closed at 60,989, likely to be hit in the coming rounds. And for OBCNCL female, 
The CSAB cutoff range was 86,000 to 94,000, and the round one closed at 82,528, likely to be hit in the coming rounds. Why this accuracy matters for you. This precision is exactly why thousands of students follow our guidance and trust our predictions year after year. These aren't random guesses, they are the result of deep data analysis, AI-powered modeling, and expert insights. If our final round predictions are already this close after round, one, you can confidently rely on our special round two predictions to help you make smart choice-filling decisions. We don't just guess, we calculate, cross-check, and validate every number to give you the best possible edge in CSAP cancelling. Before we jump to the expected cutoff ranges, make sure to subscribe to Enlighten JEE and hit the bell icon so you never miss these strategic updates that could change your college journey. Now, let's look at the expected CSAB 2025 Special Round 2. Cutoff ranges for triple IT Jabalpur. Computer Science and Engineering. For open category, gender neutral, our prediction for CSAB 2025 cutoff was 16,300 to 17,600, and for round 2, we're expecting closing between 16,500 to 17,500. For open category female, our prediction for CSAP 2025 cutoff was 25,200 to 26,700, and for round two, we're expecting closing between 25,000 to 26,500. For OBCNCL, gender neutral, we predicted 25,200 to 26,800, and for round two, we're expecting closing between 23,000 to 24,500. For OBCNCL female, we predicted 36,000 to 38,500, and for round two, we're expecting closing between 38,000 to 39,500. Electronics and Communication Engineering For open category, gender neutral, our prediction for CSAP 2025 cutoff was 20,900 to 22,300, and for round two, we're expecting closing between 20,800 to 22,000. For open category female our predicted range was 32,500 to 34,000, and we expect round 2 to close in the range of 33,500 to 34,800. For OBCNCL, gender neutral, we predicted 30,200 to 32,000 and for round 2, we're expecting closing between 28,000 to 29,500. For OBCNCL female, we predicted 44,000 to 46,000, and for round 2, we're expecting closing between 48,000 to 49,500. Mechanical Engineering For open category, gender neutral, our prediction for CSAP 2025 cutoff was 48,000 to 52,000, and for round 2, we're expecting closing between 49,000 to 50,800. For open category female, our predicted range was 61,000 to 65,000, and we expect round 2 to close in the range of 72,500 to 75,000. For OBCNCL, gender neutral, we predicted 67,500 to 72,000 and for round 2, we're expecting closing between 62,500 to 64,500. For OBCNCL female, we predicted 86,000 to 94,000, and for round 2, we're expecting closing between 85,000 to 88,000. Finally, smart manufacturing. For open category, gender neutral, round 2 is expected to close between 62,000 to 64,000. For OBCNCL, gender neutral, and we expect round 2 to be 76,000 to 79,000. Disclaimer. These predictions are based on deep analysis of the last three years of JOSER and CSAB data using AI tools and expert insight. While every care has been taken to ensure accuracy, actual cutoffs may vary depending on the number of vacant seats, category-wise competition, and final merit lists. These are expert predicted, data-driven ranges for triple ITDM Jabalpur in CSAB 2025 Special Round 2. Remember, CSAB is your second chance and with so many students withdrawing or upgrading in other institutes, and the extra round this year, ranks can still move in your favor. If you're aiming for institute or branch upgradation, CSAP 2025 Special Round 2 is your safest bet to target your seat. Subscribe to Enlighten JEE, like this video, 
and share this with friends preparing for CSAB Special Rounds 2025, it could really help them.